All right, we got two more races left for the women's division schedule this week. That's right. The first of the remaining races will feature Sasha Gisbo, who is our defending women's division champion, Jessica Claymore, and Erica Fellows, who had an impressive 2-0 record during her first two races, thanks to her incredible speed she practiced during the summer camp. There's Logan Lowry you just seen just now, and it's back to an AM records once again, as we wish the next week Demas good luck on a quest for victory. Please start the race! Alright, let's see who's gonna come on my top of this one, and it looks like Erica Fellows decided to go to rest. Trying to figure out her strategy on the only one. Sasha and Jessica are going to make their way towards the palm trees. And they'll be joined by Erica Fellows momentarily. Right on the 3D, we're also going to shake the palm trees to bring down that coconut shaped fruit. And now they're going to eat the fruit. And there goes Sasha Gizmo. She is going to have command on the lead. Followed by Jessica Claymore getting the party started in second place. And Erica Fellows is dancing in the beat back of palm trees. And Sasha gets both heading for the water as Erica Fellows wins the only toss. And there she goes. Quickly catching up to Jessica Claymore over at the bridges. And she's doing a mighty fine job, all right. Take a look at the silver child in the back. One of these silver child heading for the water. And another silver child is quarter mess. As Erica Fellows quickly make catching up to our leader, Sasha gets both up in the front. Opens this one up with back to back speeders. Sasha gets both has to leave for now, but but Erica Fellows should be on her way very shortly. As the next PS we may buy, number two, who's trying to lead number six and eight in the dust. Erica Fellows currently takes the second place, but in a moment or two, she is going to depart for Jessica Claymore and catch up to our leader, Sasha gets ball. We are at the one minute mark in the space, as number six will have the next commands be best. And right now, Jessica Claymore is getting left behind from Erica Fellows' incredible speed. She is currently stranded in fair place as she makes her way towards the sapphire portion of the of course. Oh well, if she doesn't win this week, there's always the rest of the season for Jessica Claymore. And number 7 will get the next command speed trying to gain some ground over at the back. Poor number 8, meanwhile, is getting left behind in the competition. I do believe he's going to need a couple of speedruns if he wants to get back in this one. But back to number 7. That's back to back speedruns for number 7. Curry sitting in 5th place. Meanwhile, Erica Fellows is getting back the lead from Sasha Gizmo. Can Erica Fellows prevent Sasha Gizmo from making the pass? We'll find out soon enough. Back to number 7. He was passing for more, but now he gets a fair consecutive speedruns. Oh well, it will be a meal goal for Jessica Claymore to make it all the way to first place. Oh well, that's always next time for Jessica Claymore. And who got the next one? It's number one, who leads over the fourth by Super John in fourth place. And it looks like Erica Fellows has this race all wrapped up, ladies and gentlemen. As number seven gets a four speed bus, so I'll get you a good spot. We'll have enough distance to catch up to Erica Fellows in time. Erica Fellows beats off Sasha Gizmo for the win. After forcing them to go to rest early on in the race, she beats off the defending champion Sasha Gizmo to improve the 3 0 in her cinema season. Well done. As number seven, number 8 will close out the speed race for the race. Yeah, number 8. And he leads numbers 2 and 6 in the nuts. And Erica Fellows is still undefeated. That's right, she has 3 victories in a row. What's going to happen in race number 8 to close out week 12? We'll find out the answer after we present a word from this.